Alrighty guys and gals, uh, this week we're headed out to Thunder Valley at Bristol Motor Speedway. Uh, we're going out to the drag strip for streetcar takeover. Uh, we definitely hope to see you guys here. And uh, I tell you what, I think it's going to be a good turnout. We've got great weather, good times, good friends, and uh, we'll have a good time with these hot rods. So uh, you guys sit back and enjoy the episode. Alright guys, we old Jess is here. At the entrance, yeah, and then we like first and second in line. Pretty much, we need to go at. That's right. All right, so we're waiting to hear the word. They've already got vendors and stuff set up in there, but uh, waiting to hear if they're gonna let racers and stuff go in a little bit earlier or not. But that's where we are. We're waiting, and now uh, we'll find out here in just a few. Jesse, let's see what you're drinking on over there. You know it. Like a broken record, man. <laughs> what is that? I was like, that's grape soda. What are you talking about? That's what I feared it was. <laughs> I bought two last night, stocked them up, and I was just telling you, and I said, that about brought the romantic side out of me. <laughs> Y'all know how he is. He's got to have grape soda with him everywhere he goes. I just about got you like a 12 pack of them at the grocery store the other day. I was like, no, no, we're going to be in the sun. I'm going to keep waters and stuff like that. And, now up here he comes rolled up two grape sodas <laughs> locked and loaded yeah man <laughs> look at this daggum handsome devil right here coming up coming up on us right here yeah full metal growing up with his heat waves on fmg hat the man the myth the Jesse. Let loose some water. <laughs> Did you let loose over there? Yeah, grape soda. I had to make move. <laughs> <laughs> they cleared it out, huh? Yeah. We're almost in there, though. We're almost in there. How, about, how long we got? Probably 30 minutes, probably. Yeah, we're at 1231. We got too much longer. Right, they're going to hold us out right to the daggum last right second. Right to the last minute. Oh well, it's part of it. Yeah, oh, we done tried to butter him up with a oh yeah, pork I had pork biscuit. chop biscuits this morning, grape soda, and a ham sandwich, a little bit of tater chip. <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> I'm done primed and all. <laughs> primed and all. All right then. Well, oh man. Well, it's a beautiful day today. Yeah, man. You can't beat this winter. Oh, uh, can't beat it. Feels it. like it's about. High 70s, yeah, I guess. Good. A little it's bit good. of breeze going We got some on. breeze going. I think it's going to be nice. Yeah, man. Oh, uh, man, tell you, you know what Jonesboro Armory brought us last night? What's that? They brought us a Milwaukee fan. A, uh, nice. One of those electric fans. Heck yeah. yeah. We'll have yeah, to test that. Yeah, tell me that. That's yeah, sweet, man. dude. Stop by, drop that off. That'd, That'd be pretty nice. Was it just like a, little, like a little, little normal a fan? One. It's nice. Heck yeah, man. Turn that thing on. Yeah, man. Let the fan hit our beards right. That's right, man. <laughs> we pretty dang tasty. <laughs> Be like dust in the wind, man. Uh, All right, then. Hopefully we'll wait a little bit longer when we get in here. Oh, yeah, man. We'll get there. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Let y'all see a little bit of the wait there. We in line. Waiting to get in. Rock at the 30-minute countdown mark. Um, already got a bunch of hats and stuff shipped out yesterday. Uh, definitely be sure and get you one of these new full metal goat hats. This is a small logo. Jesse, let me see your large logo. Boom. There you go. That's it. <laughs> Fancy. So be sure and get those before they're gone. I've got them here with me on site. Excuse me, at the uh, event today. So yeah, man, we've got some cool stuff going on. Again, the car's gonna be just set up on display and stuff here in a car show. Um, they normally have like a little car show over there where all the vendors are and stuff. So we'll have fun with that. Have a good time and uh, talk to everybody and watch some good racing today. So y'all be sure to come on out and come see us and uh, we'll have a good old time. All right. Rolling in finally. Heck yeah, man. <laughs> Dang, dude, we're the first ones. First ones, right off the rip. Right Digging off the it. trailer. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, right off the trailer. Let your imagination do the rest, guys. That's right. <laughs> if, if, if you know, you know. If you've seen the meme, you know what we're talking about. Uh, 
Cletus is here, got his mess set yeah, up. He's got his merch stand set up. Yeah, yeah. man. Yeah, boy. Looking good. Find our hangout pad, we'll be in there, dude. Heck yeah. There's the car show area right there, if y'all can yeah. see it. Where it normally is. Yeah. So. Yeah, man. In there, let's get in here and find a spot and get yeah. set up, guys. Let's, let's do it, dude. <laughs> All right, guys, so we got the old car set up and we're definitely one of the first ones here. Uh, we got here really early and uh, definitely appreciate all the great conversations we had. I mean, as soon as we pulled in, started getting people come up, looking at the car and talking to us about it. And uh, also um, a ton of new subscribers that we got to the channel as well, just in the first few minutes of being here. Uh, so definitely had great conversations. Um, you know, hopefully a lot of new followers and stuff on our channel to stay tuned to what all we got going on. Uh, we, had a, we had a good crowd and uh, I do apologize driving the car over here. I was wanting to have some cool footage of pulling up, but uh, unfortunately I was having a hard time with our GoPros. So hopefully we can get this fixed for the rest of the episode. All right, here. guys, we're inside the Jonesboro Armory right now. And I want to give you guys a little bit of walk through here. Definitely a big shout out to them. They're a major sponsor for us, for the GTO, and they even got our shirts in here as well. So if you're down here in Jonesboro and you pick you up a new firearm or some ammunition or any types of accessories and parts and all kinds of goodies stuff, be sure and get you a Full Metal Goat shirt as well. And uh, definitely a big shout out to them. We can't thank them enough. So give you guys a quick little walk around through here, let you guys kind of see all kinds of goodies of what they got. And uh, you guys be sure to come down here and say hello and make sure to tell them that Houston Kilby sent you their way. But anyways, guys, we'll get back at it and thank y'all for watching. All right, guys, so we're finishing up here. It ended a little bit early for us. Um, this is gonna go get the toe strap right now, which sucks. Looks like we've got the same exact shaft problem again on our oil pump. I don't know what's going on there. It keeps pushing the shaft seals out of it. Went to fire it up and uh, started blowing oil everywhere. So there we go. About to pull it back to the trailer with the golf cart. That's not going to go on with it all. Hey guys, it is what it is. Uh, we had a really good turnout, handed out a ton of uh, YouTube channel um, business cards and stuff to get more people to subscribe. And uh, that worked out really good. Uh, we had great success with that. Uh, car was running great but she's just fighting us right now. Um, we're gonna send this oil pump off or talk to some people and try to get, see what's going on. Cause I put a brand new shaft seal in it and it's still doing the same thing. So I don't know what's up or why that is that that's happening. Um, if the pump is, I, I don't know. I don't know what's happening and why it's pushing a shaft seal out of it. So we gotta find out what's going on and why that's happening. So we go from there. Other thing I'm noticing too, if this is a continual thing that can happen, um, the way I've got the uh, containment pan that's underneath the motor, it's not catching where the oil pump is. And I didn't build it to catch where it is, but I think it's time we make some changes on that too. So, seen some things, and it's time to do something about it. All right, guys, uh, we started hung out for a little bit longer, and uh, several cars started coming in, and the crowd kind of come in too. Grandstands are starting to get a few people in them over there. And um, definitely several spectators have showed up here just in the past few minutes. So the crowd has come out. Had a little minute here to talk to y'all. We have now handed out 250 uh, subscribe to the channel cards. And uh, man, it was a great day for the GOAT. Um, I'm fortunate about the oil pump and stuff, but we'll get that fixed and get it figured out. And uh, yeah, man, it's been, been a really good event. So. Yeah, it's time to go to the trailer, hook up the smoker, and uh, have some food. We're, we're starving to death. All right, guys and gals, uh, I just wanted to apologize here real quick. Uh, the next bit of footage that we got, um, I had a little bit of technical difficulties and stuff, and uh, I couldn't get some GoPros to come on on driving a car. I wish we had more footage of driving a car. I do apologize at the event. Uh, we had some very, very large crowds that hit us at this point in time. Uh, in the episode and uh, it got really really hectic for me and jesse so again guys i do apologize we didn't get better footage of this part and showing you guys the crowd and, and all the fun stuff we had talking with people but it got a little bit crazy and uh, me and jesse's been talking about how to fix this problem uh for our upcoming events and stuff and uh so again guys i apologize
All right, guys, this is actually how much traffic came in uh, during this point in time when we got kind of overwhelmed here. I just want to kind of show um, uh, Bristol had definitely had a very good turnout. Um, but it was kind of interesting. Um, all the crowd came literally like right after five or six o'clock is when we got swamped. And uh, I guess it's quitting time and where this event is on a Friday, um, it definitely was later when everybody got there. So uh, it was kind of a ghost town all day. And then right as we were thinking everything was kind of over and we were going to pack up and leave, uh, we got we got swamped hard. So anyways, apologize we didn't get better footage of uh, all the people coming in and all the cool conversations we had. But uh, we got to talk to a lot of cool people and we had a good time. Yeah. Take over families. The Jesse man. I need about five gallons of water. I told the people we get this thing back over at the trailer. We're going to daggum heat up the smoker. That smoker ain't got a chance. That's all I'm saying. Them hamburgers. Let's not even talk about that. Hot dogs. We're about to tear it up. <laughs> Good Lord, man, what are you doing? I am, man, using some of this race oil, get my beard all straightened out. It's all messed up on me. Dude. I understand. We we always do this, but guess what? You're the one that told me about this new sponsor that just come on board. Stiffy's Beard Shop. Exactly, man. Come on now. What am I doing? I had some on standby, and check this out, guys. Some real Johnson City special. You're going to have to get this on, dude. I'm telling you. Heck yeah, man. I'll do that. I'll get some of that ladies' man oil on there, and I'll be in good shape. You on. dang right, man. We'll pick a whole 10 mile an hour on the big end, dude. I'm telling you. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, yeah, guys. We're looking good now. Big shout out to Stiffy's Beard Shop. All right, guys, are you tired? Dude, I'm freaking mixed between a headache, tired, sunburnt, but it's been a good day. Oh yeah, man, it's been a real good one. Uh, we're both kind of burnt out uh, right now. You can see we've got a little bit of a suntan going on. Got the raccoon eyes. Yeah, Jesse, man. Jesse has raccoon eyes. Um, we're gonna watch a couple of last rounds here, the race here, and uh, just chill out. Get ready for the crowd to clear out so we can get out of here. But, yeah, uh, man, get the ghetto force one out of here. That's right, but man, we've had a great time. It's, it's been good. So let's watch some racing and uh, sit back and chill out. Yes, sir. Star Rocket Cruise says it's all you, Hot Rod. We got the top bombs lit. Over there. Yeah. 
Jesse, man, time to head home. Yeah, man, another one in the books. Another one in the books. Um, hate we didn't do more filming today, but we were just wide open. Uh, As wide open. always, yep. questions, 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 more questions. Yep, so on this one, uh, we wish we got more footage in, driving a car and doing stuff like that, but it is what it is. It's one of those deals. Uh, we'll make it up on the next one. But, um, oh, yeah. We, got, we had a really good turnout. We had a lot of people... Uh, you know, give them the shout outs and stuff like that. It was, it was a good time. Yeah, yeah. gain lost subscribers day and everything, man. It was a good time. Good time. Well, guys, let's head on out of here and uh, let's head home. Yeah. See y'all yeah, in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Don't forget to go over to KillMurrSports.com where we've got all kinds of merch over there and all kinds of high performance products as well. And definitely a big shout out to our sponsors and partners. Till next time, you guys have a good one.